I've always found it odd that the first thing we do when we see babies is to, uh, is to scare them. We play peekaboo, and babies somehow know that it's only playful and they don't really have to be scared. But then the same thing sort of happens when we're older. We go and see horror films, and we experience all the, the fear of, of the film, but at the same time we know that we're safe because we're not going through the trauma someone else is. Now, it's a very thin line between that and real fear, so thinking about that, I thought I'd design an arcade game. Now, zombie shoot-ups are very popular because you, uh, you get to experience all the, the thrill of the adrenaline of fighting for your life whilst in the beery, fairly mindless comfort of your local pub. This is the game. This is the game I've come up with. It's called Waking Dead, and this game is designed to put whoever plays it into a, into a catatonic trance. Basically means their sort of brain goes unraveled, they go into a vegetable-like state when they play the game. Right? Now, this doesn't work on everybody. It'll work on about a third of the people that will play it, and it will only last a few minutes, but that'll be long enough for me to do what I want to do. If you follow the cables that are coming out the back of the machine, they take us into this room. This is our control room. And in here is a very important guy called Mick. Now, Mick uh, worked on the software with me to my specifications, and Mick will be in here making the game work, controlling the zombies, and basically playing the other half of the game with the person that's going to be at the machine. You excited? Yeah. Excellent. <laughs> Mick hasn't sold his soul to Satan like the rest of us, so he's feeling a bit guilty about what's going to happen today. Uh, so we're just going to wait for someone to come in and start playing the game and take it from there. All footage inside the pub was filmed with hidden cameras. We waited and waited some more. Half an hour later, still no one has even played the game yet. Slow. Okay. Put a couple of flashes in now. And again. Another flash. Always going. One more. I'm going to go in. I'm going to go in. Hi, Darren Brown. We've been filming you playing the game. What's his name? Fabian. Fabian. That's fine. Just do exactly what I ask you to do. Come with me. Come with me. Right back. Right back. Let's just have to go. You follow me out. All right, I need you to give me a hand getting him up on the trolley. Grab his feet. I need you to come around this side and help me. We're going to keep going straight down, yep. We're going to turn onto this ramp. Ahead of us, I need you to pull the doors open towards me. Thank you. Good.
What's your name? Benedict. Benedict. And? Harry. Pardon? I'm Harry. Harry, right, come through. Straight through. Okay, come over here. All right, you take these two seats here for me. You're going to watch them. Okay. Okay, you can see him on the screen? Yeah. He's going to wake up in the game that he was just playing right. in the pub. Okay. Yeah. For real. Yeah. Okay. Just take that. One for you. Don't worry about anything. Just keep watching the monitors. Silence, please, while I sound the horn. Sit you up first, Fabian. So you can sit up. That's right. I'm going to stand you up. You can stand up for me. And keep remaining in the sleep. Take hold of the gun. We stand exactly where you as you were before. Are you on that side? Let's wake him up.
Come on, dude. It's wicked. Fuckers, isn't it? Huh? It was good. It was good. Okay, okay, let's go. Ask you a couple of questions. We uh, designed this game and just interested to hear how it was for you. It was good. It was like, I don't know. I don't know if it's because it's an arcade, but it was well, I felt like really into it. Is it going to be like put in pubs or is it? Yeah, is it's it a sort of, a, it's a prototype you're trying to develop it. No, it was good, it was good. I, I liked it a lot. It was really, I don't know, exciting. I mean, it's realistic, I don't know, you're shooting them and they don't die. <laughs> you know, so you've got to keep shooting them. And then, and then when they keep coming up again, so I don't know, it was, it was, I loved it. I just felt like, I don't know, each of them, usually in a game it's just a game, it's a cartoon. I just felt I had to kill each and every one of them I have to. I know, you're sitting here, you've got the sound coming at you and you've got the graphics. So I, I just, yeah, the sound, it all adds up to it. I don't know what you've done, if it's uh, the colours or something, but the whole, the whole setup just really gets into your head. Hello, <laughs> Shusen! some oxygen. This is not funny. Oh, it's not. Don't be too yeah. long, Excuse Mara. me. Okay. Hello. No, I <laughs> Probably not.